we just like awakened like a megalodon of spirits in the cave system below us. Photo, photo, it doesn't show up. No matter what you do, this photo does not show up. There's thousands and thousands of people. Come on out. I can see footprints in the road. I will appear. I will appear too. There's someone standing right here, guys. I'm not. Please, hey, walk over here. Walk over here and get further. There we go. The higher up our wrist goes. Dude, that's so bizarre. It just tracks something to your right shoulder. Like someone's standing over your shoulder right now. Like you are staring right. Oh my god. That's like coming from like the earth. Like I can feel it. Entrance point is right here. That's it. You're in. I mean, you can see the gate for entry. This is this first window. But that's twice I've seen like. The air going into my lungs is more dense than it should be. They saw us and then reversed. And my god. Okay, let's go with that. Oh my god. The entire building is bright red. There are five of us. Two. We got earlier. The two men. Watch the two be like these exact two people. Are you next to any one of us in particular? It smells like a dead animal over here, guys. It's glowing. This is what I saw earlier. Ooh, we're starting to feel heavy. Is that a Let's do the hatchet. Say cheese. Ikashima is an abandoned, one square kilometer and densely packed remote island with over 200 buildings still standing today. It sits off the coast of Nagasaki Prefecture in Japan. This location holds secrets and sorrows buried deep within its abandoned streets and coal mines. Once a bustling hub of industry, the island now stands as a ghostly relic, echoing the cries of those who toiled, suffered, and perhaps never left. This may be a world's first paranormal investigation of this location, and after spending nearly five hours earlier in the day exploring the houses, schools, hospitals, gymnasiums, apartment, and office buildings, with all the items still within it, we realized this would be one of our most difficult locations to investigate. In the early 20th century, Ikushima was a serene, untouched paradise known only to local fishermen. That all changed with the discovery of rich coal seams beneath its surface. The Mitsui Mining Company seized the opportunity, transforming the island into a formidable mining town. Towering smokestacks, sprawling residential complexes, and bustling marketplaces sprung up almost overnight. The island's population surged to nearly 10,000 souls, each drawn by the promise of prosperity. However, beneath the veneer of progress, they had darker reality. During World War II, the island's mines became a prison for countless Korean and Chinese laborers, forcibly brought to Japan to toil in unimaginable conditions. Under the watchful eyes of cruel overseers, these men worked long hours in the stifling heat of the coal mines, enduring frequent beatings, starvation, and abysmal living conditions. The mines, already dangerous, became death traps for many. Accidents were common, and whispers of men buried alive still circulate among those who dare to visit. The end of the war did little to improve the plight of Ikashima's workers. Labor conditions remained harsh, with miners facing perilous work environments and minimal safety measures. Strikes and protests were met with brutal suppression, adding to the island's grim reputation. The sense of despair was palpable, and many believed the island itself had absorbed the anguish of its inhabitants. As global demand for coal waned, so did Ikashima's fortunes. The 1980s marked the beginning of the end, with the final nail in the coffin being driven in 2001, when the last mine closed its gates. The exodus was swift. Homes, schools, and shops were left to rot, overtaken by nature and haunted by the ghosts of the past. Today, the once thriving community is a labyrinth of decaying buildings and empty streets, where the wind carries the echoes of a bygone era. The island's eerie silence is frequently broken by tales of paranormal activity. Locals and brave visitors report sightings of ghostly miners, their hollow eyes reflecting the eternal torment of their existence. Shadows move of their own accord, and disembodied voices whisper secrets in the darkened hallways of the old dormitories and hospitals, yet no one dares to investigate it. One of the most chilling legends is that of the vengeful miner. According to the story, a young man met a grisly end in a tunnel collapse. His spirit, they say, roams the underground passages, seeking vengeance on those who wronged him. Those who have ventured into the mines at night tell of an oppressive presence, the sensation of being watched, and the inexplicable sound of pickaxes striking rock. The abandoned Abandoned Hospital is another focal point of supernatural speculation. Once a place of healing, it now stands as a monument to despair. Visitors often speak of ghostly nurses tending to invisible patients and the spectral cries of infants echoing through the night. The air is thick with sorrow, and some claim the walls themselves bleed with the pain of those who suffered within. Despite or 
perhaps because of its haunted reputation. Ikushima attracts a steady stream of curiosity seekers. Guided tours offer a glimpse into the island's dark past, but few dare to stay after sunset. Preservation efforts are underway, but the island's ghosts seem reluctant to let go of their dominion. Ikushima stands as a chilling testament to human endurance and suffering. Its history is a tapestry woven with threads of hardship, resilience, and mystery. As the sun sets over its desolate landscape, the shadows lengthen, and the island's dark secrets come alive, inviting only the bravest to uncover its haunting tales. Luckily, on our night of investigating, we had a bit of moonlight, but that is all we're getting. This video had to be filmed entirely under night vision cameras, so we can stay under the radar. The plan is to work our way from the easier places, to get into and progress towards the most difficult. We are the only three people on our team willing to take on this challenge. If you want to see the full daytime exploration, an uncut version of this video, please check out our Patreon. Before this video begins, we actually have two really cool announcements that we want to make, which just also for the record, this Ikushima Island video is insane that we pulled it off, but I'm really, really proud to be able to share this video as a finale of the Japan series. But the first of two announcements that we have, we have another sponsor on the Overnight Channel two weeks in a row, baby. So this one is Factor, which is really cool for me because I've been using Factor for years and years and years. And when they hit me up, I was like, no way, that's awesome. So if you are looking for a nutritious, delicious meal without the hassle, seriously, don't look any further. This is just two of them. I have 15 of them right now. The best part about all these is basically most of them are ready in two minutes in the microwave. They taste fantastic. Oh, and I eat two to three of these every single day. Their gourmet chefs craft each meal using high quality ingredients so you feel your best all day. Now Factor even offers shakes. I literally have some of the protein shakes right here. They have smoothies. You've even started adding in breakfast bites. I have the egg bites here for the morning. Love they even those. have like overnight oats. I have those as well. So they're adding more and more options depending on what your needs are. And you can even choose from over 35 different options including vegan, vegetarian, calorie smart, protein plus, Whatever it is that you need that you want to mix and match with or choose from, it's there. And this happy guy with all his food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sincerely, being able to have food this great delivered to your door, being able to like mix and match whatever ones that you want, either you can go with a pre-selection or just choose your items, add things, lessen things depending on it, and just have it, especially in our case, like ready the day we get home yeah. when we're traveling. And the amount of time we now save going to grocery stores or cooking and the amount of money we save not like ordering in delivery and just yeah. having these here at the convenience of whenever I want is fantastic. Bread and chicken taco bowl. Oh, feed me. Uh-huh. Yeah, right? I know. I it's kind of sad because I make food and this is... I wish I could prove to you guys that I've been using Factor for like three years straight when they hit me up. I was like, ah! So head over to Factor75.com right now and use code HAUNTEDHOMIES50 to get 50% off of your first box and get 20% off all of your next month's orders. You can also click the link in the description. But if you guys do that, you will not regret it. Mm -hmm. At any point in time, you can pause your orders. If you feel like you're not going to be there, you can up the meals, down the meals, whatever it is. It's very flexible. Mm -hmm. It's a great service. Yeah. And it's super awesome. Get the shredded chicken taco bowl. Really good. That's and the egg bites. And the egg bites. Mm -hmm. And also the smoothies or the shakes. What's your favorite smoothie? It's your uh, shake. I like the chocolate ones. Of course you do. That, that's, a vanilla, that's where all the chocolate ones are gone. <laughs> so you're only with the vanilla I drank four today You already. have no self-control. I already drank four today. You have this giant piece of chicken. Okay, but I don't... <laughs> Thank you, Factor. Mm -hmm. A second thing that we want to announce is we're getting married next week. When this video comes out, it'll actually be exactly a week later. This video is coming out on Sunday. We're getting married August 4th. So <laughs> it's weird to talk about this with my mouth full. It's so weird. But, <laughs> but yes, yeah, so we are getting married August 4th, which means there will not be a video next week. And then we're going directly on our honeymoon after, which is we're just taking the motorhome and our dogs on a road trip. And our factors. Yeah. And our. <laughs> Honestly? Like, Actually, <laughs> yeah. No, we are. We're gonna yeah. load all the factors in the fridge. No cooking. I'm no down. Anything, just I don't want to cook. Boop boop microwave. This is great. So the honeymoon will be for two weeks. So the next video will be like around the end of August. Oh. Uh, it's actually with Patty and Linda. It was a phenomenal, phenomenal video. Um, Jay, I just want to mm -hmm. give you a little heads up. That's why there's gonna be a little pause and upload. So I thought you said our honeymoon was with Patty and Linda. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, when did that happen? That's nope. fun. I you love me, that. You, me, and the dogs up the coast, just hopefully doing absolutely nothing yeah. except my quipping our backers. <laughs> so. So romantic. <laughs> yeah. So that's that's a little update there. 
And then, uh, yeah, we'll be back to weekly videos after that. Um, UK is coming up, fun stuff, and some other, I don't know, I don't want to get you ahead of the curve. Yeah, okay. don't get too ahead of it. Alright. So this is like practice for the wedding, feeding the cake. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, Here, you practice. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm ready. Oh, that's a lot. Eat the cake. Okay. Mm. Okay. Alright, enjoy this video. It's a really, really cool one. And, um, glad we pulled it off. Also, Three of us were the only ones that were willing to do this one because it was too uh, dangerous. Dangerous would be the, that's, that's how we're gonna phrase it for YouTube standards. Yeah. Okay, enjoy the video. See bye. you guys in a couple weeks as well. All right, bye. reviewing the drone footage and uh, looking for how to connect all these together and the I'm gonna get directionally wrong but the side closest to the harbor here the port has a staircase that connects up into the apartment building system and the apartment building system connects to the school so I mean it's, it's a city but now it's just once we get through here there's a stairwell up we just have to be mindful of falling through anything. Anyone who has not seen our previous Japan videos and you're thinking to yourself right now, you're in Japan, you're not speaking Japanese, the spirits can't hear you. Well, we also had that exact same thought process our very first night in Akigahara and our belief system was basically that language is a human construct, right, but human to human you can communicate with each other emotionally, right? You can look at someone, understand how they feel, you can hear what they say, and understand what they're saying without actually knowing the words. So our belief is that emotion and language transcends the spirit world, and in that exact same breath, we got confirmation by the spirits in Akigahara that they could 100% understand us and communicate with us. So that is how we operate now, no matter where we go in the world. This is incredible. On the drone, I thought it was four feet tall. Oh my god. Apologies for filming the entire video on the body cameras, but this is the best way to do it. Dude, that is, it, that, that's just, look at the stars. Dude, what a, what a beautiful shot. Remembers the mall cannonball. Do you actually? Yeah, behind me. Bro, you saw those? I saw those. Bro, you were a fan? Yeah, Let's I go. didn't even realize it was you though. Oh, that's so funny. crazy. Alright, step one complete. High five. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna turn on the spirit talker. And I'm gonna lower the volume. And we need to be very careful. There's less than a hundred people that live on the island. And we already know all of the tourists are in the hotel we're in. Yeah, that's like true. inside, all the cars are there. I'm upset. Okay, we're gonna lower your volume. Uh, Many died here. Many died, dude. Yeah, ha Hashima Island, otherwise known as Battleship Island, is only by boat an hour that way. And it was uh, recently confirmed, although not acknowledged, by Japan. No now that they were using Hashima Island uh, for prisoners of war, forced labor, brutal punishments, mm -hmm. just relentless death to them and a lot more that was kept secret and this is literally a neighbor of the exact same business model. They definitely have documentation of like fatalities here and pretty catastrophic injuries. That's no surprise. Anything else is speculation because the the new one is connected to the old one right so it is a wing of the existing one okay so, they, so they probably just took a section they shut down yes 
yeah, I think they just refurbished a section of it and, and kept that running. Back to you, sir. Bodies below. Bodies below. This is the mine entrance. In my quarter. In my quarter. As in like their quarters? Oh my god, is that a person? Yo, yo, is that a person? There's someone standing right here. Hey, there's someone standing right here. Hi, hi. Hi. I'm trying to turn my light on. Dude, there's someone standing right here. I will appear. I will appear. Dude, there's someone standing right here, guys. I'm not... Please, hey, walk over here. Walk over here and, and point it at this. Dude, there's... Someone's standing right here. Statue? Please tell me it's a statue. Oh, it's a statue. Holy... Yeah, it's a statue. Okay, I'm glad I'm not delusional when I said I saw someone. The statue of heat? Yeah, there's heat. It's hot. Oh, shit. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Yeah, dude, there's so much heat inside this statue. That's so weird. It's glowing. This is what I saw earlier. It's glowing. What the heck? I think I found our entrance. Okay, we are not going in this building under any circumstance. I am sorry. It's absolutely collapsed. I mean, there's wood shrapnel all the way over here. Steel shut, completely shut. We're not breaking any doors, not that sh But if it's open, it's open. Communication. Okay. Yeah, this is the, uh, this is the, and this is actually the, the lowering system. Look, all these right here are the cables. Oh, yeah. Uh, I spent time at Cerro Gordo for a little bit. And that's exactly what this is. Yeah, so this is the pulley system. So this is how they would lower the crew members down. Yeah. into the mine shaft system itself and then the tunnel system over there is where they would pull out any of the coal and this is where it says bodies below and it would totally make sense because yeah. the majority of key accidents happened and down there yeah, and, and in general just in the shaft system trying to go children. for children oh, no. yeah and that was the theory one of the theories is yeah. forced child labor yeah okay let's keep going around because we're just we're here to investigate, we're not here to uh, explore. Well, die. Okay, we're here to communicate. You've said many have died here down below, including children. Can you tell us, were any of these deaths, were they accidents? Were these people that chose to work here and something tragic happened? Or were you forced to work here against your will? It's weird how peaceful it is. Believe us. Believe us. We will. We oh, because everyone denies. Mm. Literally, Hashima, UNESCO, has literally said to Japan, you have to admit this is true, and Japan goes, no. Like, no. They're not doing they're it. They're so upset about it. Yeah. Well, we're here to believe anything that you tell us. We want to know the truth. We're here in peace. Came here to communicate. Came here to learn about your story. My name is Jerry, by the way. And if you want to play, you know, we have tools on us. Please feel free to grab the energy from any of the tools that we have. From the body cameras, from my thermo. Do you want to introduce yourself? Up. Up. Is that where you were? Is that where you are? Well, that was cool. I swear I just saw someone like in that window up there. Which one 
one. This one right here. I should swear. I'm I, from the 1800s. I'm from the 1800s. Born late 1800s, then yeah, you would have been. You could have worked here without any doubt. Nice to meet you. Whoever's here, my name is Ginger. I come to visit with all respect. I'm looking forward to learning more about you, and I'm sorry to hear all the things that happened here, especially to the children. We're here to believe what you tell us. We're here to learn and to communicate. Feel free to use our devices. We can set out more later as well. And we'll be listening, looking, asking questions. Hi. I'm Elton. All of us actually are from the United States. And I do realize we are in the Nagasaki area. Um, I just want to state this. We were not alive when any of those events happened, nor do any of us condone or support. You're scared of me. You're scared of me. I do sound like I'm scared, don't I? <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm not scared. I just I just want to be respectful and and also be mindful of where we are and knowing what country we're from. If uh our accent kind of agitates you or brings out any form of emotions. Our country is now friends, we're at peace, and uh, that's all. I'm not scared of you, but I would like to ask who is the person I keep seeing? No, I didn't. Hmm. It's a different person. Though. Different person. Okay, then do you know who I keep seeing in this window? It scared me the first and second time. Do you see what I'm talking about? It's this first window. The lower left. Right here. It's right in the corner. I think it might even be boarded up, but that's twice I've seen, like, human-sized glowing eyes. There's, like, it's red. No. It's rose. It's, like, so up on top, roof. Right underneath, there's, like, a window right there. It's red. And there's like this little orange thing that keeps peeping out. I can't tell what it is. Oh my god, it just peeping. It's just bright orange peeping out of the window. Again, there's, I mean, obviously there's no power, there's no anything here right no. now. Yeah, that window. I think that's the same window you're talking about right there, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. We want to walk around tonight and see if we can gather evidence of other spirits or energies that might be here. And if we can get that proof. We are apprehensive. We're apprehensive. Okay. Okay. That's okay. The reason why we're here and we want this proof is if you enjoy it and we can prove that you are here, more people might come and be able to talk to you and, and know where to go and how to talk to you. And you won't be alone here anymore. That's our intention tonight. Just here to chat. Okay. Should we make our way around? Yeah. I don't know how to get through this without going into death trap of a building. I kind of just want to show people like what this death trap of a building looks like real quick. It's massive. See, now the orange thing is gone. Really? Yeah. You were just up there, huh? It does look like you could, but I'm not going to. We 
Let us rest. Let us rest. Okay. Okay. Okay, we'll, we'll change areas, yeah? Let me just check before the roof caves in on us. This smells like dead animal. Um, children's laughter dies. Children's laughter dies. It smells like a dead animal over here, guys. I just want to see if we can even get through this before. Can you stay with Ginger? Whoa, all the headlamp gear. Yeah, headlamp gear. Um, sled gurneys for emergencies. Mansion holds tragedy. Mansion holds tragedy. Uh, this is worth seeing. It's really cool if you just want to come in. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'm assuming this is the wash. I think this is the wash station for the miners. All, all gear and miners themselves. Sinks. Mansion holds tragedy as I walked into the biggest room I've seen so far. We're all around you. I know you said you want us to let you rest. I apologize. We're not even trying to communicate now. We're actually just looking around to learn about this place. Every single one of these is a sink tap, which means that they believe that at one point, 150 miners at the same time. At the same time. I mean, 10,000 people lived here in its peak. They said to let them rest, so I'm not trying to push for our answers right here. Although it would be really cool. Before we leave, just want to make sure you truly do not want to speak to us, correct? Because once we leave, we will not be coming back here. Whoa. What the? Before we leave, just want to make sure you truly do not want to speak to us, correct? Because once we leave, we will not be coming back here. Jack, prep room and post room, right? Yeah. Like everything in here is cleaning, bathroom, supplies, lockers. Storage. The land. The land. Oh, Are these all pictures? No. Cement shoes. 
cement shoes. Dude, look at this. Wait, wait, cement shoes is like... When someone gets thrown in the lake, yeah. cement shoes. Exactly. Would do yeah. that. Oh my god, look at all the photos. They look so young. I mean, these are actual children. Those are actual, these are no, these are actual children. These are kids whining. I mean, that's gotta be like a six year old, a six year old maybe. Yeah, dude, look at these. 15. Hey, look, that's right here. That's the statue. That's where we just were. Dude, these are children. I mean, field trip maybe, but may maybe to give a benefit of the doubt. Yeah. so weird. This one doesn't show up. Look. Photo, photo, it doesn't show up. Look at my screen. No matter what you do, this oh, photo does not show oh, up. Oh, why? I, there, there, there. That one's, like, they're all. Children are playing. And it's nothing but kids. Dude. Are any of you here in this picture? Are any of you in this picture that are around us right now? Oh my God, there's more pictures here. Do come in. What is this? Do look at all these. More? Yeah. Also, lead paint. We don't have respirators on, so try not to be in this room too long. Whoa, old scopes. Let's go to this hallway. Do one Panasonic. Messages that maybe there are children that are still trapped here to this day. If any of the kids can hear us, can you let us know in whatever way is best for you? Nobody talks to us. Okay, that was a great way of letting us know, okay? Yeah. Well, thank you for listening and talking with us, okay? Can you tell us how you're feeling? Nurse. Nurse. Pain. Okay, you're in pain. Um, where are you hurting? Can you tell us what body part or whatever way you can describe it? Did you get hurt here? inside the mine? Was it through an accident? Did something major happen? There's anything we I can... I am not Were you the nurse here? Did you witness the children? 
Did you also get hurt? I've always wondered this and maybe you can answer it. When you pass away, if you passed away at the age of 10, are you still at age? Or have you grown older? Are you now in your 50s? Ending. Okay, you're back. I've had no okay. pain. Not back pain this time. Just like lungs, like uh, esophagus and a diaphragm. What like, do you feel in tightness? After, it just feels like it's like um, clouding up. It feels like it's getting dense in there and it's like if the air going into my lungs is more dense than it should be. Does that make you feel heavier in here? Yeah. Like thicker. Are you are you showing us where you were hurt by putting the pain through Elton? That's a new one for me. I've That's never felt it like that. I felt back pain lungs. and headaches, but that was like right here. Dude. If if that's their way of communicating through ultimates, their minds. That was the question I just asked. Yeah. Right? Where does it hurt? How did it hurt you? And I did no. say in the best way that we're, oh my God, I did. I said in the best way that works for you. Right. And it stopped speaking after that. listen to that one back but it sounded like something like time never ends mm. I couldn't get it I just I, I heard time never ends but very very and then it just right there murder did you feel like you were forced to do this kind of work They were not all from Japan. That's very they true. They came from all over the world, That's all very, these different countries. Can you ask them something in like in Mandarin? Like so, you know I mean? Don't even tell us. Let me try it. Niao, I want to ask you. You are in this side. 失去你的生命吗? 我看起来像是 你们某一个家人吗? 
还是我看起来像你们的爸爸？如果你会讲中文的话，请。跟我，如果你是从台湾或中国来的话，对呀，这是你。Yeah, what you ask? I ask if you are Chinese or Taiwanese. Talk to me. I know everyone here speaks Japanese, but I could communicate with you in Chinese. And he said here. Anniversary. 好，我们现在在二楼了。是你在三楼吗？刚刚在窗户看到的是你吗？Second or the third floor? Is that what we saw? And it said two men here. And I saw two different times a set of eyes. One, two. What is this? Are these all lights? Yeah. Yeah. So this room is specifically for lights. On the outside, there's a oh. label. For what? 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 No way. Where? Oh my God. Bro. Jesus Christ. Ooh, I've never had a woman make me drop to my knees so fast. Oh my God. Henry. All the radios are here. Everyone's radio, radio pouches. It's kind of a new. That's a new breaker. How are you feeling? Yeah. No, I just don't feel it. It comes and goes. Yeah. yeah. Most of these are all in Chinese. Most. No. Most labels here are in Chinese. These are Japanese. But a lot of these are, like even the back. So that would make sense if it's a Chinese manufacturer, then they're probably here to obviously oversee everything, make sure gear's running, and with that you bring your family, you bring your kids, and more people show up, right? End up working here. Your kids grow up, they end up working here. They end up going into the mines. 
Maybe this one with the red glass. Chad. Wow, one with the red glass. Shoes. Look, dude, a hatchet. I don't know. This feels more like a classroom. Like, like kids' classroom. A legitimate. Yeah. yeah. There's a chalk. There's like chalkboards over here. Presentation. Yeah. What does it say? Uh, what'd you hear? Yeah, okay. Um, that flag, I think that's Malaysian flag or Indonesian flag. Yeah, that, yeah, I, yeah, that makes sense. So, if it's Malaysian or Indonesian, there's a heavy influence of Chinese within those countries as well. I think, yeah, this is the, uh, this is it. Wait, so that means... That means what I saw came from the classroom. There's holes everywhere. This is where they learn how to do emergency, like safeties and stuff. Yeah. Dude, there's like a brand new bottle of Coke. What the heck? Yeah. Huh. Okay, so that means what I saw came from what did you find? What is it? Shrine? Some short shrine, yeah. Can you point your light on this tree? Oh yeah, it is. It's a shrine. Wow. Help me. Help me. I mean, yeah, pray before you go down into the mine shafts, right? I mean, this is it. Look, here. Entrance point is right here. That's it, you're in. I mean, you can see the gate for entry. This is where they start. This yeah. Is the entrance. So right look there. at it right there too. Shows them all marching in. Oh, does that say entrance? Yeah, so that says entrance right there. And then these are basically like the signs to let them know what come like which uh which entrance mm. um the car comes in and things like that. And what depth and right. Wow. I mean I'm sure this that is... says do not enter. That says uh, uh like bomb. Oh, like explosives. 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 Explosives, there you go. Got it. That says explosives. Those are the entries, and then that says card. Gotcha. It's crazy that you can read that. It's all Japanese, right? Kanji. That's Japanese? Kanji is like very, it's Japanese, but similar, very similar to Chinese, like writing. They're the same. Oh. Yeah. That's crazy that you can read all that. Okay. Yeah. I wonder what this is for. Like self-check. It says self-check uh, right okay. here. Okay, that makes sense. Yep, so you, make sure man. you check your safeties before you. Uh, yep, that totally makes sense. Yeah. Check yourself, sign mm -hmm. in, pray, go. That's, wow. And these are all the safety rules. Yeah, these are all the safety rules. Wow. Okay, I just want to go where this window was yeah. and just hopefully there's a mannequin there. So the window had to have been right here. You've got to be careful. Yeah, it had to have been here. Or I guess one up. What are you trying to warn us? One up, let's go one up. Are you trying to warn us something about the third floor? Does this building feel crooked now? A little bit. Hey, does it feel? A little bit. Just okay. Like it. it does like, actually feel crooked right Lady. now. Lady. Lady, yeah. Sure. Please, no more mannequins. Please, no more mannequins. Please, no more mannequins. No more mannequins or statues, please. Okay, here's the window. Found it. These are like all offices. Yeah, these are like the research rooms. 
Oh, that smells like. What's that smell? Careful on your feet. Yeah, this is the corner. You may already that's a No. Nothing. Should we keep going? It's not out of disrespect, it's more so that there's so much more ground to cover. Yeah. Angel hierarchy. Angel hierarchy. I've never heard that one. Really? Oh, English. Is that the first English we've seen? Central monitoring instrument, instrument classroom. classroom. This right here is a Chinese flag. This is the is it actually? Look at Oh yeah. Indonesia, Japan, China. Could be the biggest building. With classrooms. And the entry. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead to find the staircase down. Supper. Suffered. 90% of what we have gotten, we have been able to like directly tie into what we're asking or where we are. Down to talking about the children who might be here, going down the route of the Chinese and finding the Chinese gear. Like everything is. Yeah. What? Just goes and goes and goes. Everything left behind. Could be a staircase here. Right, I love how it went from apprehension to basically just talking to us as much as I can. But also, I don't think a lot of people ever come visit here with them, though. We're family. Did I say we're family? We're family. We're family. That's what you asked? Do I look like someone who's family? Yeah. yeah. My heart gave in. Oh yeah, we were talking about it. we started with apprehension. Yeah. We did. And we're getting more answers. We're family, my heart gave in. Mm. Good, good. Are you able to follow us throughout the island? Or are you are you stuck here in this building? Left. 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 Does that I assume that means you're able to leave? feeling again. You're feeling it? Yeah. What's what's this look like? Oh yeah, this is that. Yep. Around here, around that way. Could you join us tonight as we keep walking around the island? And maybe you can help us speak to other spirits that are here. They'll probably be apprehensive as well, just like you were. So maybe by you being a friendly face to them, they'll want to talk to us a little bit more easily and comfortably. We came from a little bit one more further. Okay, once we leave this building, it's going to get harder and harder to get to the next ones. Take a picture. Take a picture. What's up, Haika? Say cheese. She's in the Check the corner. Dead end. There's five of us. There's five of us. Two. We got earlier. The two men. There's two five men. of us. One, two, three, two yeah. men. And yeah, as we're leaving, guess. I mean, we literally have just exited. Hannah. Hannah? Anna? Hannah. Hannah, I think. There's five of us. We have two people with us right now. I should have done this first. 
<laughs> it's 66.0 degrees right now. That's crazy. There's five of us now. Are you next to any one of us in particular? Right here. What? That's amazing. They are here. Okay, there's one. Where's two? Can you show us where you are? Let's see. Right Might just be moving then. Footsteps. Footsteps. You probably had this when I was alone in the forest. It was just on and in my vest the whole time. Watch the two be like these exact two people. Couldn't find a placard or anything. Yeah, man and son. Dude, look where we just were in, now that we can actually see it. Oh, so we were the stairwell. Yeah. Oh, that is actually it. Oh, wow. Yeah. We were exactly where I thought we were. Yeah. And nothing was there. Cool. All right, back where we came from. So there's definitely a staircase back here. Oh, the plant. Oh, my God, dude. Do I scare you? <laughs> Do I scare you? No. No. Also, wasn't that one of the first things you're scared of me? Yeah. I don't know if there's a way through there. I think maybe we can go around this. Put something in your hair. Let me get it for you. Thank you, flower. Get a sakura. Right? What's it? Yeah, it was a cherry blossom petal. Aww. Watch that be like, wait, how'd you get a cherry blossom petal in your hair? Actually, you're inside. And like, there's no cherry blossom there. Uh -uh. Side of the island. That's really weird. Yeah, we saw all the only cherry blossoms, even on drone. I saw all the cherry blossoms. <laughs> Watch, you were just like blessed. Shh, shh. Hush, I heard something. I hear something. I hear a little where towards where a car is. You guys hear that? Ginger, turn around and listen. 180. Do you hear this? Like, I hear it not even through the parabolic mic. Genevieve. Yes. Yeah. No, there's no more ferries. There's no more boats coming here. They're not allowed to come here until 7 in the morning. What is that then? Like a mine machine? It sounds like, like, yeah. Do you hear this? Like, I hear it not even through the parabolic mic. Genevieve. Yes. Yeah. Gears turning. But no, there's no more ferries. There's no more boats coming here. They're not allowed to come here until 7 in the morning. What is that then? Like a mine machine? It sounds like, like, yeah. That's like coming from like the earth. Like I can feel it in the ground. So they are able to have you feel what they felt and now we're hearing what they heard. Or it's is that like, right? The two people who are with us? Is that what's happening right now to us? That's crazy. Among, oh my God, Hi, know, everyone. Hi, everyone. Yeah. Oh my God, do you know the dong, 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 
Is that Mike picking it up or no? This one? Yeah. Yeah. It does, okay. Yeah. like our two friends be like calling to all the spirits on the island right now watch we just like awaken like a megalodon of spirits in the in the cave system below us in the mine system you hear that? yeah it's still there it, it feels like like the mine shaft is just like I wonder how loud it was when it was operating it was probably so loud you know, yeah Let's see if we can find a way to these stairs. Hmm. Is it worth Atmosphere. It? Atmosphere as well. The atmosphere is getting charged, like the area, the yeah. island. That better be another statue, dude. I think I can turn my light on here. We're in a little, like... Giant, I saw it on the drone. It's a giant staircase. I just Who checked. killed me? Who killed you? English. Did a family member kill you? Was it a boss? Co-worker? Savage Knight. A savage Knight. So he was, they were working. I think this is the stairwell right here. Yep, got it. I wonder if there was, you know, a night shift and a day shift. Oh, absolutely. 12 hour shifts. Yeah. Rotate them in and out, yep. I wonder if more accidents did happen at night. Okay, we gotta go back down to no lights and let our eyes adjust again. I understand you. Okay. Okay, twos. Ob objective one is complete. The mine shaft building. Next is up about 500 stairs to the apartments. The, I think, six or six to eight story apartment building. As we all know, the further in we go, the higher up our risk goes. Yeah. And I'm going to turn off the K2 for the sake of light. So here's what I'll do. I'm going to mute it completely. And uh, I'll look later when we get to the next spot to see what was said to us. Okay. But I think for now, let's just focus on getting up the stairs and getting in the next set of buildings. Okay. All right, luckily we have a handrail. Rail feels good. Can't get over the stars. They're just incredible. What's that? Something just fell. Something just fell on the left, and I have been on the handrail the whole time. Okay. Like something like a piece of paper, almost like a ball of paper got thrown. There's a wire above us right here. Uh, we might be in a bit of a pickle here. I think I see a fence. Oh, there's barbed wire. Except for right here. It's clear. And right here is clear I think the best way over is going to be right here like this left foot left foot right foot and then left foot right foot
Hole will shift a little, just so you know. Prepare for it to shift. the audio gun on. It was a person talking. Is someone going to say that? Wait, wait, wait. You heard that too? I heard that before I had the audio gun on. It was a person talking. So we're clear in this section. We're on the main roads again. Yeah. That the closer we go that way, the closer we get to where people are living. So that's what concerns me. Hotel is that way. Yeah. But the people living are a decent chunk away that way. And we're sure because we look. Hotel is that way. But the people living are a decent chunk away that way. And we're sure because we look. I heard that so clear. Uh, people. It was so clear. I heard it not through the headphones. I couldn't turn around fast enough. Did you hear it or no? You did too? I'm behind, like in this building, right? Oh, you heard from that way? I heard from that way. Okay, let's try this one. And then there's no chance we can go through all these buildings. There's a thousand apartments here. There's no chance, so let's just pick a building. We have our friends with us. Let's go this way and see what's the first one we can walk into. Wait, I turned off the spear talker. Yeah. Did it just speak? Dude, it literally said. You should be scared. Oh my god. Oh my god. It said, uh, okay, we're really here. Lungs should be scared. You will see me. You will see me. Battle here. See. 
like ocean sea. I was in the military. Growl. You just heard the fell. And then just got Lillian right now. What's crazy is we're getting real world things that are matching that, but we haven't looked at it. Growl and and lungs. Yeah, I thought I turned it on. I muted it. Building behind you. Building behind you. I'm gonna see if that static is still here. This entire building was just going the whole thing. Like right here. There's a door right here. There's a door right here. No. It's like all of the trees have grown through the doors. Scared, knock because it gets lonely. That's the full sequence of everything right now. You're trying to get into yeah. Knock? Does that mean like knock and introduce yourself? Yeah, what are the lights? I'm scared, knock because it gets lonely. So, let's try and just get to one of the doors, I guess. Yeah, how, do we get, how do we get in here? Like right through this cut through right here? Yes. It's not open. Right there. It's oh, those are the doors. Yeah, those are the doors. I understand. Okay. So the doors are unsealed. Yeah. They're not sealed. A lot of them you can open it. It's just they're closed. No, oh, it's closed open. I think that's fine. They can. Let's go test them. You just them. have to slide them. Oh. Let's do yeah. That. Yeah. I thought they were boarded shut. No, if it's just a door, you gotta open. If they do open, I think we should knock and say hello before we go in. Is that a bullet hole? Nah, these are... These are closed. I feel like we don't need to go in the building. I'm not trying to make a cop out here, but we're in the middle of all of the buildings right now. I don't know why I keep pointing it's like you can see anything, but we're in the middle of all the buildings, so why not just knock on that door? And, and do it from out here? And just say hello from here. I mean, we already have two friends with us. That's true. So they can probably, and then everyone can just look out the window and see us. All right, back to the door. Hello. Hello, this is Jerry. Just want to come here and say hello and introduce myself. We're new here to the island. Wanted to invite all of you out to just chat and, you know, want to understand and connect with you. I have two friends with me here. I have Elton and Ginger, and I believe we have yeah. two other friends that just came along that we met earlier. Actually, keep going. Turn your light off. Keep going. Okay. Whatever you're doing just worked. Sorry, I snapped. So I just want to say, come on and chat with us. Come party with us. Bring everybody out. Hey, I know there's a lot, a lot of you guys here, right? I mean, 
there's thousands and thousands of you out. So, come on out. We have a lot, a lot of tools and toys that you can feed energy off of and just show us who you are. Show us what y'all are about. Let us understand you. We're here to chat. Light, 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 light. Building's lighting up. Right here, this building on the right is lighting up. It's the whole next building over is flickering. It's starting to glow. I'm gonna go into the route. Well, that was like enough flicker to make me think headlights were about to come around the corner. I thought we were about to have like a car pull up on us. Should I come out? I would keep going, whatever you were just doing. Between those noises and the whole building just lighting up. Hey. Sounds like you guys like to get the party started, right? Come out. This is so crazy. I can see footprints in the road. Dude, I can see actual footprints. I can't tell which way they're going. Did you just turn a light on? You didn't? If all of you are here, let us help you. I know a lot of y'all are in pain. I know a lot of y'all are in pain. I know a lot of y'all have gone through a lot of suffering here. This place has been abandoned for a reason. I know a lot of people don't come. And we're here to talk and we're here you finally have visitors. You know, you finally have visitors that are gonna come here to connect with you in such a, such a deep, deep level. I know you get tourists, but no one cares about you, right? We do. We wanna hear from you. Please, feel free to come out. Oh my God. The entire building is bright red. But it's just the top floor. Regular, regular. The top floor, oh my god. This is insane. Spirit Talker said, yes, we're here. Fast and mystical, the devil is calling. Last time I got devil is calling is Akihara, Akigahara. Please, if there's any negative energy here, we're not here to cause any harm. We just want to chat with the positive energy. Did you just touch me? No. Oh my god. Why am I 
just like this. Okay. Oh my god, okay. Go ahead, go ahead. Something just tapped Ginger in the back. I hope the camera caught it. But hey, if you are the positive or negative entity, if you're the positive or negative entity, again, we're here, it mean no harm. We know there's been a lot of suffering here. Dude, my, my legs are shaking right now. Let me see if the footsteps showed up. No, but the path is brighter now. Where? I don't know which way. Where? There's something new, bright red that wasn't there before. This, I, I can't, I don't know what it is. But this is bright red, and this was not bright red before. I want to go figure out what turned bright red here, because I have all the video that it was never red. And now it's, and that came closer to us. Jerry, I'm going to go check what this is. Um, can you keep doing what you're doing and I'm going to walk up? to go back to the van. They'll catch up to us way faster. So we have to like be ready to go into the bushes and not, you know, get hurt. Let's go for the van and as dumb as it sounds, we might be able to like investigate from the car. <laughs> With thermal and everything else, you know what I mean? Like if they really can join us anywhere on the island, then why not join us in the car? I really all I'm filming is grass. <laughs> I'm just like buried in a bush. I said let's go for it. Watch out. Should be a real thing that's in front of us. There's a van. There's no other car. Dude, there's something in the trees. There's like an actual like. Is there anyone around here? I have a device here called K2. Feel free to grab some energy from this. 
If you are around, show us. Positive or negative, I did ask you to show us who you are and what you are. Okay, I have dowsing rods. If you can point them to where Elton saw something. Are you trying to keep them super still? Can you point these to where Elton saw something? Right there? Is that where you saw it? Okay, let me get closer. Okay, so something right about here. The area. I wonder what this area used to be. It seems like it got teared down. This is what I'm going to do, okay? I'm going to leave this K2 right here on the floor. This is where you were pointing us to. Was this place something that was commonly used before? Was this an area that people would commonly be? Yes. Yes. Was that you that Jerry just heard? Was that you that Jerry just heard? It sounded like clink, 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 like dishes. Are you the same one that Jerry just heard right now? Are you making noises and appearing as an orb? It says no on my end. Mm. What the K2? Was this... A restaurant, a bar, somewhere, somewhere you find entertainment together with your friends as a group. So we know this was an area popularly used. It has amazing views. Maybe it was a restaurant or bar. Maybe it was a park for children. There were a lot of children here. Maybe not. It's pointing at you. Nope, not sleeping. Can you show us a direction of where you are right now? That way? That altar. Okay, so you're over there. Maybe just to the left of Elton. Which is where it pointed before. Wait, is this where you saw the I saw like right, almost like probably exactly where you're standing. And Jerry just heard some noises over here too. Yeah. Yep. So you were standing. It was like a clink, 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 noise. That was coming from like right here. So we were trying to ask, was this like a first question was, was this a highly populated area huh. in the city? Yeah. You know, and they said yes. So we're trying to figure out, like, what was it? Was it a restaurant? Was it a bar? Was it uh, a this was is also, there? this is also the highest cliff on the entire island. That right over there on that side is the, we're at the highest point of the island right now. Okay. And the highest cliff. Closest to the mines. 
very close to the houses. Oh, yeah, the mines are right down there. Yeah, the mines are right where we started, yeah. This is the absolutely what what was that? So there's a beaker. Yeah. This is where I need out the highest point of the island. Like I flew the whole drone over this place. And there's a sheer drop right on the other side here. So if you want to talk about highly populated and seeing a white orb and everything else. We also talked about it being a kids car which could line up with the clinking of swings, chair, swing set, things like that. Jerry, can you hold your left hand out and walk towards that bush, but please do not fall off the edge? My autofocus uh, has been tracking something in the bush. Yeah, my, my, my face detection is tracking something in this bush to your right. Hard right, yep, keep going. It's locked on something, keep going. Five more feet. It's not fully in the bush. So you don't have to like go all the way in. That K2 goes off though. Keep going. Five more feet. Forward right. Forward right. More. Five five feet. Almost there. To your right a little bit more. Keep going. Right there I have something. Yeah, like you're standing on it and the camera's just going in and out of focus non-stop. Yup, right there. This is so weird. Maybe it's something that we can use capitals for. Like Raise your hand up higher. Yeah, I mean you're on it. I don't know. Can I put capitals on? For the sake of people watching, I really want to go back through where we just had that hole. I know it sounds stupid, but I really want to go back where those buildings are, both this camera out. Because public roads are public roads. Yeah, this is true. Oh, that's, dude, that's so bizarre. It just tracks something to your right shoulder. Like someone's standing over your shoulder right now. Like you were staring right, oh my God. It's straight up tracking it. Yeah, higher. It needs to be yellow. This is so weird. Looks like I'm the worst camera guy ever because everything's out of focus. Really? Oh, grabbed your hand. It, it brought you back into focus right now. Whoa. First time. I haven't touched anything on this. I'm just chilling, holding it. I forget I have a camera right here. Huh. I mean, if you, any place you want to try dowsing rods in between all the buildings. Yeah. I mean, we saw what happened. As soon as you started knocking and talking, we heard those crazy noises. And then I don't know if that... You saw footprints? I saw footprints. And then on thermal, I, I can see where the footprints were. And I saw, I scanned the whole area. And then afterwards, there was like a whole new area that was lit up. And it was by this gate. So I wonder if we go back over to that gate. That's like, seems to be the hot spot that's like charged. Yeah. There's any place to like try dowsing rods or another Panasonic session. Yeah. 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 Let's go over there. Yeah. Let's do it. This is so funny having a body camera on my face. Cause I'm I'm just so zoned in on the screen, like filming. This angle is probably just like my eyeballs just. I think the hospital is just the dumbest thing in the world. You think so? Just yeah. Right next to you. I mean, it is it's smack dab in between an active active being in use hospital and the fire department on an island where the only way off is the ferry you know what i mean yeah. it's like how many americans are here right now with this camera and we already had to mark down our license plate earlier yeah and so they drove past us already so yeah they must have had a tip that some people were out exactly dude how does evan do this 
Oh my god, props to that. Evan, you're, you're a beast. What, it's getting heavy? I've only been holding this thing for 9 minutes and 38 seconds, and I'm already like, ugh. Huh? Oh, that's true. Yeah, let me do that. Let me try that. Let me try that quick. Yeah, Evan is always doing this stuff, huh? Always. Oh, that is, oh, it looks cool, though. Oh, I get why he does it. Yeah. Yeah, oh, shit. Oh. I get why he does it, though. He scared me. He wanted to do a TikTok dance. I was going to say, twins. What have, have you been? been? Nobody knows me like you do. Right. No fact. <laughs> It's so funny is I can just do this to you guys. What the? <laughs> I can just turn it on, blind you, turn it off, run away. Where have you been? <laughs> <laughs> Twins. Oh my god. Okay. Let's get back to that same spot. Oh, here we go. Now we can see the building. Alright, let's crank this up. There we go. Wait, what? Wait, what? It came from that way. What did? Hold on. Huh? What'd you hear? <laughs> what? Did you fart? God damn it. You farted? Farted. farted. Oh my god. <laughs> it scared me. Why, did your, why does your fart sound like a 12 year old female ghost? <laughs> His fart goes boom. <laughs> Bro, why does your fart sound like a 12 year old ghost? Oh, I haven't pooped in two days, dude. Bro, it literally went, huh? Alone, I'm sorry. Oh my god. This part goes deep. Alright, we're getting too goofy. So I saw heat come from just past. So footsteps were. Yeah, I did. I saw it come from the gate right here. So it came from right here on this gate. So I saw the footprints right here, right here. They, you know, they stopped right about here, exactly where I am. And then afterwards, after you started doing what you were doing, this, I think either this pole or this wall was bright red. I, I'm assuming it has to be the wall because it was way too dense. Yeah. I mean, I'm fine. Oh, car coming. I'll just leave it on. Yeah. No. I don't, I don't like that. It feels like a warning to me. Dad. Yeah. You did say don't test our work for the third time. And we came back for the third time, bro. Yeah, that's... Uh, that's oh, they're coming. Yeah, You're fine. That's weird. Why would it just back up like that? Yeah, it's completely reversing. I don't like that. Okay, let's go to the car. I don't like it at all. That one felt weird. 
They saw us and then reversed. Yeah, why, why don't you just drive by? Like, if they're tourists. Still there. No, he's reversing. He's like doing a three point turn. That's. Completely shut off, dude. Yeah, I don't like. I don't. Now I feel like someone's gonna sneak up on us and just try and kill us. Okay, okay. Don't. Okay, don't think that. Okay. What the heck? Why? That doesn't make sense. Why would you do that? Yeah, that was. It's bizarre. You, if if you're not doing anything wrong, if there's like us, they would have just drove by. Right? If they yeah, tourists, or like, if oh, they thought we were doing something wrong, they would have driven up to us. And talked to us and told us, hey. But, but instead they reverse and turn off their lights and then... You hear and now the car's still idling. Hear the engine. Are they just watching us now? <laughs> you still hear the engine. Okay. Okay. Let's, uh, yeah. They can definitely see us. For the sake of not going to Japanese jail, uh, eight hours before our flight home, I feel like we've done what no one has done before, which is come here and investigate. Right. And like actually like have good evidence. And between thermal and audio and the conversations and seeing what we saw and learning what we saw, I feel like this is a good starting point to maybe reach out to them and actually see if they, we can get permission. To, like to go full, into the school, to go into the hospital and be like, hey, like, it would be incredible to be able to do this. And also, it could bring more people here, you know, if they want more tourism. Respectfully. You know Respectfully. I mean? Respectfully. Because it's an incredible place. Yeah. We'll definitely be back. Imagine we get permission for Hashima Island, too. First ones ever to get permission to go to Hashima. Be insane to actually get permission. No one's got, no one's ever been granted permission there, ever. But I don't know how they'd feel about us doing a paranormal investigation there. That, that arguably, that and Paviglia might be like the two most haunted islands in the entire world. Yeah, that was the weirdest thing with that car. That was weird. Like, I didn't, I didn't like that at all. That felt very that, sketchy. Like, that to me feels like, especially knowing that we saw bullet holes in the glass door. That to me felt like, oh, That was, them. I see you, now I'm gonna go hide, is what that was. Yeah, and like, leave the car running so we think they're in the car, oh. and then oh. they're actually somewhere else. That's what that felt like. I don't know, that one, I'd much rather like have a face-to-face -face encounter with you, but reversing and hiding and turning yeah. your head. What, who are you looking for? Because we were not hiding either. No, we no. just were right there. That's light, full blast. Jerry was right in the light, so they could definitely see him. You know, so what else are they looking for? I wonder if they're, they, they've been hearing or seeing people all night that... And they're like, well, it's not them. Because <laughs> we're too obvious. Like, what if they've been seeing and hearing what we've been hearing and seeing? Oh, gosh. Because when we first came up the staircase, we heard people in the yeah. buildings. yep. So what if, I don't know, what if security is looking for what we're looking for? And, not, not, and they're like, well, obviously it's not them because they have giant lights and cameras. Yeah. I don't know. That's the only other option I could think of. Imagine security right now is like hunting for ghosts, but they think it's like <laughs> people like us. They but, think it's trespassers. And that's what, yeah, exactly. Right, and they can actually... never catch them. That's our last investigation in Japan. We've had this since day one. So I think it's, let's say, goodbye to our two friends that we made tonight and anyone else that's with us. And then uh, finally use this and then wrap up like our, our openness to the spirits here in Japan. It's like seven kinds of uh, sacred water. And thank you to the uh, two spirits that joined us tonight that gave us so many answers. And uh, anyone else that may have joined us or with us now, we appreciate it. And we hope to be able to share your existence with others, since it did seem that you enjoyed talking with us. This spray here is meant to disconnect us from your world and possibly also can unbind you from where you are. So please, you might want to step away from us now 
because I do not know what happens if we unbind you from here, yet you are physically still here, versus when I did it at the forest, you yeah. could walk off, mm -hmm. you know? Yep, yep. Okay. You spray, spray it first, you spray it into the air, and then waft it in. Does that smell weird any of you? Doesn't smell weird to you? Smell like bad to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't think I was like spraying myself with like rotten eggs. It's weird. I'll take my hand. Doesn't, doesn't, yeah, I don't doesn't, doesn't smell weird to you? Do it again. You guys, like, doesn't it smell bad to you? No. <laughs> spray, spray a little more. This smells like really not pleasant to me. Spray a little more. Let, let, let it smells it. like fart spray. I'm not trying to like be disrespectful, but it smells like. No. <laughs> you know, now you just scared me. <laughs> you came right at me. <laughs> yeah, I should. Get that, get that devil team or whatever the hell I am. Don't hurt little Sadie. Maybe if that's what it is. It's just she did say you don't need this. Remember? Oh yeah. So that's why you're smelling eggs. I'm smelling Sadie's bad breath, just like, <gasps> get it away, get it away. Yeah. It's just my little demon just like blowing it away. If anyone has no idea what little Sadie means, it's, you watched the end of this video. You, you've you seen the other videos. Thanks, We Lil had Sadie. a mission. We hit one and two thirds out of four. I'll take it. For a place that no one's ever done before. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Every intention to come back. Mm-hmm. Japan was a crazy trip. It's I can't phenomenal. believe it's over already. It's Three phenomenal. nights. Two nights for y'all in Akigahara. Three nights for me in Akigahara. And you were in there in the pouring rain. Himuru Mansion. Yeah. And that debacle trying to get up there. Insane. God. And then driving 10 hours plus ferry. Yeah. To get here. Yep. To a very secluded island. Secluded yeah. island. We can't leave till the ferry starts again tomorrow. And then we fly home. It's been a fun Japan series. Thanks for watching. Comment other places that you want to see us go. Let us know. Pavigli Island might actually be happening with permission from like the Italian government. Real we're, official. We're very, very close right now to confirming that. And if you do Paviglia, then we might as well do catacombs. But like do it like a crazier way. Crazy? Yeah. Huh? There's ideas of brewing. But let me know. Let me know if there's something else. He's always got ideas. You wanna see? Why did you do that? I don't know. Every once in a while I just see big balls of light. When you do that, it just makes me okay. scared. Okay, well it also just... makes me scared. That's why I do it. <laughs> I don't just sharply look over at things I that like are... That. Well, it's not my fault. Okay. I, sometimes I see sharp... I see big balls of light and I go, what the, is that? And then I get scared. And then you do that and then I get scared. What? Are you what, scared? What, Jerry? No, I'm scared of both of y'all. <laughs> 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 we should have said that. We should have said that. We should have said that, said that to We should have said that. Hello, we my friend. We should have just said that oh to them. God. How do I say goodbye, my friend? Zai jian, pai yu. Say it again? Zai jian. Zai? Zai jian. Chai? Zai. Spell it. Zai. Zai? Like T-S. Spell it. I don't even know how to Zai. spell it. Spell it phonetically. <laughs> spell it the way you would say it. Like if you saw it on a piece of paper. T-Z? Z. Z-H. Zai. 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 Yeah, Zai jian. Spell chen. Jen. 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 Oh, J Jen. J E N. J J I N J E N. Jen. Jen. Zai Jin. There you go. Zai Jin. Yeah. You're natural. Look at that. Zai Jin. Zai Jin. Zai Jin. Zai Jin. Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> Where did the demon get me? Right here. Where did the demon get me? You dot 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 and huge bruise. How? Can you feel it? Yeah. How about now? Meow, yeah. Meow.
Can you feel that? Stop it, yeah. What? Yeah, stop it. It tickles in, it hurts. I don't like it. You did You did it. Stop. 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 Stop.